Hey you guys, I'm switching up someplace. As you can see, I am inside our office um, at home. Um, I wanted to say thank you so much. And um, this hair is uh, Ava's hair. It's straight Brazilian uh, hair and it's amazing. I think it's like 20, I wanna say it's 20 inches, but I'll double check the length of the hair. And as always, I love you guys. And um, if you're new to this channel, welcome. If you are my subscriber, thank you so much for always supporting me. And I am always excited to bring you guys new, more product. I love this video. And if you do, don't forget to give thumbs up and like and subscribe and share my channel. So as always, thank you so much. Hey you guys, so right now I am going to use the Got To Be Glue um, in yellow bottle. Uh, what I'm doing is I use my finger, which um, I shouldn't have. I should use something else to apply it, but it's my first time doing it. And so I'm going to apply it at the edge of my hairline and then um, go all the way around in the front. And so I'm going to use my finger... <laughs> And honestly, I should have just took my time, but I was rushing and I had to go somewhere. But um, anyways, I thought I wanted to just put a video out for you guys to kind of see uh, this beautiful hair. But um, so I'm applying all around the hair, the got to be glue, and um, I'm pulling it down because it keeps going up. But I'm using my finger and to kind of lightly Put the gel around it and then not too much because I'm gonna put more layer on it so I'm just trying to focus and um, using my finger to do so so um, hey you guys okay right now I am gonna be using um, my blow dryer you can use any blow dryer on a cold uh, a low the low part hey of it. Hey guys, right now I'm um, using scissors and to use cut that it off until your hair edges. The gel take part your is time to brush. Um, and honestly, I wish I waited a little bit uh, um, to so make sure that it's, it's low, completely dry. Not enough. I think high heat, I so um, you don't want it to be melting. And a little um, bit so too just do that fast, until so you I'm feel like the gel is getting clear, and then you can stop and also apply it again. So I did that about three times. All right, you guys, as you can see, I definitely messed this up. So it's my first time. As I said, um, there's always a room for improvement. But I just wanted to show you guys the hair quality and how it looks. And so I'm just getting ready to um, install the hair. It is absolutely beautiful. It's like, I don't know, this hair is just amazing. The hair is full it's like 360 it's so thick um, it's a lot of hair and um, I'm really really excited to show you guys it's beautiful I combed it and I also washed it and air dry it uh, overnight um, so it's still there's no tangling nor shedding so far so good I love the hair and I can't wait to try it and I will show you guys an update on the hair um, so it comes with clips inside of the hair um, there is a back you can adjust it and also the comb if you want you can clip it um, I'm just gonna glue it obviously I have um, I don't want to use the clip yet but at least you have an option so you can adjust it and make it smaller to fit your head um, but uh, make sure you do that in the back so that the back side is make sure it's secure and tight that's what I'm doing right now and hopefully it is gonna fit and sit perfectly and I'm gonna start putting it in the back first not in the front so put the comb in the back of your hair sorry you guys can't see me but my goodness look at this it's absolutely beautiful I'm not even done yet um, but I'm trying to figure out the adjustment on the front um, as you can see the hair in the back is like a good um, at least it's the front toe is just amazing it's very full and it's very natural it also comes pre-plucked um, I haven't done anything with it I'm just basically trying to adjust it to fit into like my front and then I'm gonna go back and um, apply makeup on it and but right now I'm just trying to see how it looks before I can uh, glue it down so I'm pulling and seeing what it looks like but um, I just love this hair you guys it's absolutely amazing 
and now I'm just going to use a rubber band to have the hair pull back so that way it's not um, going to be in the way when I apply with the gel. The got to be glue and I don't want it to be in the front of, um, of it. So just to kind of keep the hair back away from the front is what I'm doing right now. And then I'm pulling it back because the, the cap is white and it doesn't match my scalp. So I'm going to use a foundation. Any foundation would work, honestly, if you have it at home. So I'm just going to use what I have and dab it on um, so that way it's like less white. The foundation kind of helps matches your your scalp. So hopefully this works. I'm just going to put all around it and to kind of cover the white part of it. So that's what I'm doing. You can pretty much use whatever color you like. and. just going back and touching it up with makeup um, my foundation uh, the part that I feel like it needs to be blended a little bit um, otherwise it looks pretty good it's not bad I hope you guys like it um, basically I'm just gonna brush it up actually right now sorry I'm gonna clean it up with um, uh, alcohol and you just basically clean the area that I see in white spot and I'm going to try to get rid of it and uh, the glue I kind of have um, around my uh, forehead and just going to be cleaning that area up um, it's just an excess product and um, so it's pretty easy uh, you just clean use any cotton you can even use a paper towel with water too to just wipe down but that's what I'm doing right now just looking at it and make sure that nothing is around um, cleaning it up and I'm about to basically brush the hair oh my god you guys I love this hair it feels so nice it just I don't know it feels soft and it's a lot of hair as I said um, it is it is very long so um, this hair is uh, 20 inches I want to say but I wanted to just uh, be clear so I'll find the exact length uh, I need to find the paperwork but 
it is one of my favorite weeks so far and I love playing with it and um, so yeah I'm almost done and I'm just gonna use a brush and edge control to kind of put the hair to lay down a little bit um, I haven't used any heat no flat iron yet I just installed it just to show you guys how it looks and so I'm pretty much I don't like to use a lot of my baby hair so as you can see I'm just using the brush to kind of help me uh, keep the baby hair flat and um, to kind of cover the front part of the, the uh, lace to cover and just you can honestly use your finger too or a comb uh, you don't need a toothbrush to use it and you can also use any brush that you have at home um, pretty much to just help the uh, lay the baby hair flat and so um, I really like it I you just need a little product not a whole lot of product as you can see um, I'm pretty much just trying to maneuver it and it's not the best baby hair out but hey it looks looks good for a time <laughs> Um, anyways, and so I'm done with that, and I am getting ready to, um, leave the, the part is in the middle, it came like that, so I just kept it kind of, uh, in the middle for now. You can do any size, but, um, the side that I chose to keep is in the front, um, uh, which is in the middle part, and as you can see, I am all done, and I hope you guys love this. It is my first time, so, um... Yeah, I haven't done it with got to be got to be glue. Sorry, I can't even speak. Um, but so far I really enjoy the process of it, and um, I just next time I need to take the time, my time doing so. But um, pulling it down to show you guys the length, it is basically uh, past. It's in, like honestly, it's in my waist, past my belly button. In the middle part, it's really long. So. Um, it is absolutely gorgeous. I love this hair. I can't stop playing with it. Oh my gosh. So I will um, try to use heat next time. So I will try that and show you guys how it does. And I will also follow up and update on this hair next time. So I hope you enjoy it. And from the beginning to end I hope you enjoy that and um, anyway so I wanted to say thank you again and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel as always I'm really appreciative of you guys and um, also hit the button the bell button so that you don't miss anything uh, next time I upload all right talk to you guys later ciao